we're the same age, trying to get CJ to be a uh, WFA champion by the end of this video. I don't know if we will be. She doesn't do a lot of damage just yet, so the issue with that, I have to fight a certain way. And this guy does a lot of damage, it looks like, and he's way faster than I am. Even though we have similar stats. So that's, you know, but look how fast he's going, how many strikes he's throwing. He is teeing off. It's okay, though. He's gonna fold. They always do. They spam a lot, they dodge a lot, they sway a lot, but then when they sway into my foot, to their fucking skull, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. So I ain't even worried about it. Officer in the line. Let's go. There we go. You think that uppercut would like do something there, but not a lot of damage, so we gotta be careful. How we play this. One thing I never really got in this game. How do you stop from just walking out of your clinch? Because when I go for the clinch, the computer typically just like gets right out of it. But um, okay. And also that effect. I'm pretty sure that effect means like you got like a perfect counter. But sometimes people get countered by me and it doesn't do that. So it's kind of like a highlight reel for the opponent. Interesting. I'm like way slower than I was catching for a bit there, but try to claim she punches through it. Okay, keep that in mind. He doesn't handle my uppercuts too well, but he dodges all my straights and hooks. There we go. Go again. They're not doing a lot of damage now, but they add up. Okay. Lock. I was like really try. I can't really like joke around because he's really good apparently according to the game. Not sure why he's so good, but he is. Because my character shot's not high. Oh, you're going for a takedown. By the way, he's not a wrestler, by the way. This guy's a kickboxer. That's another thing I want to keep in mind. When you turn up difficulty in this game, they say turn up the aggression on takedowns because those are the hardest things to stop. It's easy to just take punches and then fucking punch them in the next week in front of their family. But they will get a takedown and, and smell your dick for some reason. So, you know, that's cool. <laughs> As you can see, I'm kind of annoyed with the whole speed thing. It's, it's, it's dumb, it's dumb, but it's whatever. Like, I get it, but also I can't train to be much better when I'm here, so it's what it is. I can try, but fitness will be low sometimes, bro. That's how it is. He cut me. He's eating jabs all day. He's swaying my punches, yep. If I go to the body, he runs away. So really it's like, it comes down to, I might have to actually try to wrestle him. Cause if I try to just stand here and try to fight with him, he's gonna be faster. And he's gonna be getting pieced up, taking the necessary damage and eventually knocking him out when he slows down from dodging so much. Go back to the body again. To the body again. Body again. Body again. You just gonna keep letting me do it and I'll keep doing it, bro. And he blocks the head kick. How? I don't know. I don't know how he read the head kick, but there's a body kick again. There we go. Mm -hmm. no. I know he's gonna sway, so I'm not even gonna bother trying to go for like any punches right now. I'm gonna clinch him up and try to catch him. Yep. Tried it, didn't work. 
They have Dr. Stavis in WFA? I don't know. They might. Wow, that's really surprising how he read that. He's hurting me. Yeah, my punches do zero fucking damage apparently. How am I hitting you with an uppercut you lean into and you're not getting rocked by it? That's wild. There we go. Fight it. Right, go to the body. There we go. Jabs. Mm, there we go. There we go. There we go. I'm not going to try it again because I know what he's going to do. He's going to just avoid it. Should have thrown the uppercut because they always duck. I set up everything though with straights, so. Are you ready? Come on, let's go. There we go, get fucking folded. Now, what changed within those rounds to where he just decided he was just gonna let me just hit him with a bunch of hooks? I don't know. But, worked out. Caught him while he was falling, that's dirty. Mm. Couldn't block if he wanted to. That's some insane precision. That caught him on the fucking chin. So another one bites the dust. Gonna see a lot more of those. Looks like everything is going according to plan. I should be able to uh, do this fight and not have to worry about anyone pulling out or anything. Really grinding out here. Trying to get get all my stats up and what have you. You know, taking a few injuries here and there. But I feel like for the most part, I think my character is ready to win the championship now. We got Trent Booker 10 and 1. Um, as you saw, we had a few opponents who were like pretty, pretty light work. Look at that. Look at that, I mean, who else is doing it like that? It's crazy though, because Mathis gave us such a problem and these guys just whitewashed them. So, you know, maybe I'll have to face Mathis again for the championship, I don't know. Uh, but Trent Booker has, oh, he's a two and a half stars kickboxer. Since it's a championship fight, I am going to turn difficulty up for this. It's a championship fight. So, I did have Mathis on a hard though, so that, that might have been a difference. I didn't. I did not have them on easy. I right, had them on normal. I had Mathis on the hard because it was the first fight of the video, and I, I was like, I mean, no one wants to see me just whitewash somebody immediately, right? So here we go for the championship. WFA World Fighting Alliance, and I think I have after this fight, or yeah, after this fight, I have three more fights. So I got three title defenses, and then I can go to UFC. If I win, of course. Are you ready? Time to fight. Let's go. So we're gonna keep some feet. Check this shit. Mm. Good block, good block. Okay. I'm faster now, so. There's hope. Oh, okay. He's fast too. Mm. There we go. There we go. To the body. To the body. I don't know what it is that Lee Roundhouse keeps to the body. They ain't ready for it. Ooh, took him up top that time. Let's let's go dip. Okay. okay, so I like how he got to hang on to the click while I was trying to get out. It's interesting. Interesting to note. 
Mm, there we go. Mm -hmm. Kick to the body, nice. Another kick to the body, let's go. Clinches a lot. When he gets the clinch, he does get some success there. I haven't really taken too much damage from it though. So that's on the bright side. Get the hoist block to that time, good punish. And block the electric though. Oh that one. Mmm. So he's a south bar or is he just in that stance right now? Maybe he's or maybe he's uh ant or whatever the title is like Okay. Nice. Oh wow, he tripped me. Can't believe he tried to level all down, dickhead. Okay. Hmm. This is a little scrap we got going on. I'm starting to read him a little bit though. Went to the body. Went to the body again, didn't get it. Went to the body again. He's, he's not coming forward anymore. There we go. I mean, if you don't want to come forward, I'll meet you. Oh, I kicked him clean in the head and then I got fucking tripped. He's. He having a hard time recovering from that kick, that's noted. They don't take these roundhouses too well. I mean, who would, you know? Mm. <laughs> There's a few people who can take them. I don't know what it is, but they can take them. Freaking Kevin Holland. Pretty nice. Oh! oh! no! He went for the clinch again and I was out of range. Oh my goodness, that's what I was kicking. Because I feel like I was like, okay, well, if I just stay in kicking range and make him reach, I can punish him. I wasn't expecting that though. Oh my goodness, no type of protection. Headshot, dead indeed. Damn. Oh. He didn't see that kick coming at all. I and mean, he took the first one bad, like real bad. I like tripped and everything. He was still rocked by the time I got back to him. Did not take long to finish him. Let's freaking go, man. I do 111 strength? God damn, bro. I was there swinging for the damn fences. He was not prepared at all, was he? Not at all. A dirt decrease to a level that is negatively affecting your attributes to review your endorsed attributes into your fire your evolution on the career hub and recover them. How does my longevity decrease at all? I bro, I barely took anything. That was a sparring session and he got knocked out. That's what that was. <laughs> you never stood a chance. But who's my first opponent for the title? Let me fuck around and find out right quick. Let's see. Harris Rush. Did I fight this guy, Harrison Rush? I'm pretty sure I did. I'm not gonna do it. I don't know if I want to... Yeah. Oh, he's my rival, though. Mmm. He is my rival. I beat him in 58 seconds. I fought him twice already? Yeah, I'm not... Nah, bro. Nah. Nah, bro. I beat you in 58 seconds, and I beat you twice. I mean, there's no reason... And you're number seven? There's no reason for me to give you a title shot, bro. No. Is that is that like a dick move? Maybe. But I beat this dude twice, bro. There's no, there's no reason. And I beat this guy too. Great. We just, we're just stuck in the cycle of hatred, I guess. I'm not liking my chances in this fight. I'm not liking them one bit. Because while CJ has hands, as you saw, it's still not necessarily easy to hit people. But, you know, championship fight, I made it look easy, I guess. But Lucy's hands are nowhere near that. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Yep. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Juggernaut. Juggernaut, okay. They said the fight style that'd be useful, but uh, it's okay. Oh, she got the shirt on. She might be a wrestler. Uh, oh shit, that's not good. 
There we go. There we go. Mm. This ain't gonna be good, I don't think. I might, I'm probably gonna get hurt. I know I'm gonna get hurt, actually. Mm. Basically, I'm just trying to set her up to get him to the ground. Okay. Ooh, okay. Wait a minute. Ooh. Hey, we, we might have this. Hold up. Ah, damn. Damn, I thought I had her. I was pretty confident about that one. I'm surprised I didn't hurt her right there when she reached in like that, unprotected. I think it's still just a power discrepancy. Okay. Okay. Good move, good move. And blocks my leg kick. There we go, up top. Mm. Good shit. Nice. So I can get her to the ground if I go for a takedown, I'm noticing that. Off the uh, the last attempt to get into her ground, but problem with that is if I get her there, she knows she can just get right back up. How did that not land? Must have not between the line. Oh, she goes for a takedown. There we go. Okay. Okay. I was worried, man. I was worried. Once we get our stats high enough, the performances are going to be a lot more uh, impressive. But because, you know, early seasons of the career and all that, strikes are going to be really as effective. And they see the Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu fighters, so, you know, of course, not when we get to the ground, I'm going to try to do work. We got the submission. Couple training sessions with Valentina. Got another easy win. But this opponent here is supposed to be a little tougher. I know her record don't say that, but check her out though. Jasmine Alvarez. She kind of bad with it, you know what I'm saying? Three and a half. Kickboxer. You know I have trouble on the feet. Especially when you know they got they got hands. Like that was a big problem for uh for Lucy. But we got this fight and we got one more fight after this. So if this fight's gonna be the, the big fight, and then we'll have like a a little finish to show at the end. I don't know, but regardless, but I put in that work. There, were, oh, there was some stuff on social media. Here we go. Uh, what slick groundwork from Golden Star? Impressive finish. Congrats. Thanks, I guess, Jasmine. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to take that as a compliment from a white belt like you. Damn. Yeah, she don't really. Well, I mean, I think you can say she is a white belt because she's primarily focused on kickboxing. But then again. Would that make me a white belt in kickboxing? Alright, almost ready to go with this one. Here is tonight's tale of the day. We set it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Got the reach advantage, but she outweighs me. I wonder if weight plays a factor in stamina when it comes to going for takedowns in this game. Hey, Haymaker, you better throw you better throw at least one haymaker. 
You better throw at least one haymaker or you're a fraud. Let's go. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot my um. My health ain't perfect. There we go. Mm, that's, that's not good. She can't be landing those. That was free right there. That was also free. Can't do that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So they, they, yeah no more kicks for me. Yeah. Easy man. Fuck it. Fuck kicks. There we go. Mm, there we go. That's where it is. I might kick the leg, I might kick the leg, but I ain't really thinking about it right now. Mm. 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 See, that's where it's at. Mm, little side step. Mm. Oh, you better block that. Watch this leave. Oh, she leaves me though. Oh, okay. Try to surprise her by going for some of these. You know, strikes the hands and go for a kick. Okay. So I was going to catch her when she sat back up, but I did not. Knee. There we go. Okay, kick me in the leg again. Yeah. yeah we're not playing that game. There we go. There we go. I mean, you know, I'll just keep doing it. Oh, <laughs> Ooh, good move. Okay. Mmm. Over here, well, we doing work on the feet. Ooh, still got the overhand off. I don't know how you got the overhand off while you were locked in my clinch, but that's fine. I don't know who's winning this round. To be honest with you, I think I'm throwing more, so I'm landing more. I'm more active, but I think she's winning between the strikes. I feel like her head moving is great too. She's making me miss a lot. Ooh, but that damage is important. Damage is important. Yeah! Wow! I didn't think I was gonna do her like that. Lucy is a demon. Oh my goodness! Lucy is a demon. I thought she was gonna. I thought. I thought for sure. Right there, she was getting out. Lucy brought that leg over like Elastigirl. girl. Goddamn. That's ridiculous. This ain't no final form. Not yet. We did really good on the feet this time compared to what we normally do. That it might be me getting better at the game. Or improving the stats, I don't know. We but we did that. The octagon, Bruce has the With the Kimura, damn, bro. Referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, twenty-four seconds of the very first round. Mm -hmm. Playing the winner by tap out due to a Kimura Golden. Let's go. Well, how about this young woman? Yeah, if this is the last big fight, go ahead and leave a like on the video. We're, we're gonna see. I was hoping by the time we got to our 10th fight, we would be facing a ring fighter next, but that's how it be, bro. We'll find out, though. We'll find out right now. Ain't no way. Well, here we go. We got ourselves a fight. Paige Van Zandt for the number 15 spot. Let's fucking go then, bro. Let's get in here. That's who's next. No trash talk. Just four weeks of straight training. You say nothing but a word to me. Let's do it. I'm not feeling too confident about this one. Like, yeah, eight and six. Yeah, I'm four and a half stars. You know what I mean? And Paige Van Zandt, I really know for being like the greatest UFC fighter ever. And she is, you know, got lower stats than I do. I am undefeated. She's eight and six. You know what I mean? Like, there's, there's something going on. You know, there's some, some things that are in my favor, but I don't have enough um my health isn't looking too good and she's a kickboxer i just i just don't like my chances i, just, I don't i feel like I'm, it's perfectly reasonable for me to not think i can win this fight but maybe i'll get to maybe i'll get her who knows i might catch her slip hey lucy could you know potentially get a KO for one most likely not gonna happen we got the size we're younger taller 
gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC. Oh, no, man. Flyweight division. Introducing first. Fighting out of the blue corner. Golden. The old line getting put down by the young line, perhaps, you could say. Fighting out of the red corner. Well, Cage, Cage, Bassad. I wish she would have stuck with wrestling. I don't know if she's still trained, but... I mean, that would have been cool. What if she joined up with Ronda? That would have been pretty sick, I think. They, they probably don't like each other. I don't know. Ooh! Okay. Mm. Ooh, again? You got shot in the front case, dog. But we kind of doing it right now. We just kind of in her face a little bit. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, okay. There you go. Mm. Dude, she is she working on the lower half of the kick. She ain't working on blocking these fucking kicks from landing. God damn, bro. Hey, we might do this. This might be light work. Oh, oh, okay, okay, good move, good move. Oh shit. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. She ain't got power like that though, so should I be worried? She's going for a takedown. You don't want to go down the ground with me, I will choke you out. I might go for arm bar just because they talked about you have an arm injury, which is fucked up, but you know. Ooh, good shit, good shit. She fainted with it and caught him with it anyway. She told me what she was, she like whispered to me what she was going to hit me with and then I took it like I was in fucking dirty me or some shit. Oh my goodness. Ooh, that's not, that's not clean enough. Okay. Ooh, good leg kick. Here's my leg kick. Oh, again. He's clutching me, but I'm definitely winning this round. Okay. A little Matrix action. I see you. Mmm. As for uppercut, you guys, DC, you weren't talking about me. Damn. We all here just trading on the feet. You know how I do. Okay, good block. Mmm, again? Dang, oh wow, you fucked up. I almost got her up out of there. That was a sick transition by her on the ground though when I had her in the arm boy. That was so clean. Deep choke. I ain't have no no choke. I only went for arm bars. Look at this. Deep choke. What are you talking about? We thought it was done. It looked so tight. I thought it was done. But she was able to relax. Really take a breath. Find a way Ready out fight. of such a very Ready. dangerous situation. Alright, hey, first first fight, I think they go to the no, not the first fight to go to the second round of the video. Second fight. Or the whole video. First fight for Lucy to go to the second round. Ooh, okay. Ooh, okay. She's turning up a little bit, but that, that might deter her a little bit. Yeah, she might get dropped with the hand. When she gets going into a messed up oh you messed up I stood back up because she was draining my stamina while I was down there, so probably better for me to get back up and reset up another good position. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, 
Wow. That was actually pretty sick. She got out of it and I just went right into another one. <laughs> That's performance of the night right there. We're in the top 15. Let's go. Oh my goodness. She couldn't stop front kicks. And it was on full display tonight as she gets another submission victory. Imagine getting out of a heel hook just to reposition yourself for another heel hook. There's levels, man. Holy shit. All right, now we go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is calling stop. We're going to get CJ and you have seen the next uh, episode for sure. Number two. Winner, He's gonna get a couple of title defenses and then uh, you can get called up. I don't think I'll have to go through the contender series either from what I understand. I mean, I don't see why a champion in another promotion would have to do that, but LSF motion ain't big enough. But everybody know about the war fighting alliance, you know what I'm saying? Everyone knows about that. That was dope, though. Did I get a bonus? How? That was a, that was a solid performance for me. I won the first round, okay. Bro, how did I not? Whatever. I mean, I got my contract bonus at least. I'm gonna start talking about those more contract bonuses so y'all know what I gotta do. Some more content for the video. Thanks for watching. Oh shit. Actually, you know what? I kinda wanna see who's next before we end this one. Cause I don't think I'm gonna decline my, my next opponent. I have had to face some people twice though, I noticed that. Which is fine, but like, you know, at least I would be better than they were last time I fought them. That will help out. Who's next on the agenda? Oh, John Anna wants to say something about being top 15. Question for Lucy. Do you have anyone in your science now after earning a place in top 15? Uh, anyone and everyone, if they are above me in the rankings, I want to find them. Business as usual, I knew I would get here. I know I'll keep climbing. Uh, what's it? Why does it say guaranteed fight offer? What does it even mean? Of course we're going to get a fight offer no matter what. I'm getting the fans, bro. Give me the fans. Let's go. Plus 500. Who are you? I guess someone coming after my spy. Have I already fought you? I'm going to decline if I already fought you. Because that's a pitiful, pitiful look. But if you if you worked your way here, you got up here to fight me, I'll give you your props and I'll let you fight me. Clearly, clearly they must be good enough to fight, you know, rank number 15 if they're, if they're, you know, fighting me, so. Six weeks of training for you? No. Four weeks. Fuck out my face. Light work. 